Wittenberg University is currently taking extreme precautions following an email that threatened a potential shooting on campus tomorrow, Sunday, September 15, 2024. The message targeted Haitian members of our community. Wittenberg police are cooperating with the Springfield Police Division and the FBI to investigate this threat. All students, faculty, and staff should exercise extreme precaution and be alert to all your surroundings. If you see anything suspicious or information about the threat, contact Wittenberg Police Division immediately. The Springfield Police Division will increase patrols on campus tomorrow. If you are on or near campus, prepare for additional instructions or a lockdown. If we learn more from the ongoing investigation, all activities are canceled on Sunday, September 15th. University administrators recognize that the city of Springfield has experienced an increase in threats to local government, businesses, and schools in the past week. We take this threat seriously and will provide updates to the campus as we learn more about the situation. So remember, Donald Trump today was asked to call out the bomb threats, say that it's not okay, and he didn't do that. Instead, he said the problem were the immigrants. J.D. Vance, however, uh, he, he did um, denounce the threats, but he did it in the middle of a post that began with racist fear-mongering that causes threats, and then afterwards followed up with more racist fear-mongering that, you know, causes threats. Also, J.D. Vance still uh, won't defend his wife or kids. That's where we're at, right? We have another day, more terroristic threats coming from MAGA, and Donald Trump is loving it because Donald Trump is seeing this and thinking, you know what? We can keep this up. We can threaten people uh, when we go vote. We when we lose, we can threaten people in, in D.C. We can try to do a second January 6th. He's seeing that the groundwork it might work. He doesn't care how many kids die or innocent people die. It's just, you know... His, he, he's enjoying it. He's enjoying it because it gives him attention, I assume. In some way, I think he really likes this. Also, the threat was to Haitian members of the community. And I, I watched some interviews with members of the Springfield community, and something that a lot of them said was, they aren't Haitian, but they get mistaken for it because they're black. So this threat here is just to kill black people. And you know who's not going to condemn it? Donald Trump. 